Tracking your most accurate forecast, I'm meteorologist Jorge Torres. Temperatures will be on the cool side still tomorrow, uh, even with clear skies. Your forecast showing temperatures in the morning, staying in the mid 40s and climbing slowly throughout the day in the lower 60s by midday and reaching the upper 60s by the afternoon and cooling down once again throughout the night. Now, as far as the activity planner, can't really complain. You'll need morning layers, though, in the morning. We're talking temperatures in the 40s throughout the Phoenix Metro. So for you runners, hikers and bikers, keep that in mind. But through the afternoon, anticipating a relatively nice day. So there is the disturbance is crossing through Arizona now, producing some lingering snow showers in parts of the high country, along with breezy to windy conditions, mainly in western parts of the state. That'll be out of here by Tuesday, and we do expect clearing skies for a while until about Thursday when another storm moves into the north and west, meaning another round of rain, snow, wind, and cooler temperatures, at least briefly, before the storm begins to move out late Thursday night into early Friday morning. And then high pressure begins to build this weekend, meaning warmer temperatures should return. In fact, for Sunday, we're calling for highs to bounce back into the 80s here in the valley. Now, as far as tonight, we expect overnight lows anywhere from 7 at the Grand Canyon to 8 degrees across the Navajo Nation and in Flagstaff down to 10 tonight. Throughout the lower deserts, chilly too, with lows in the mid-30s from Tucson to Casa Grande. Mid-40s, though, in the Phoenix Metro and to the west as well there in Lake Havasu City and Bullhead City too. Highs tomorrow. Slowly warming up, but still below average. We should be in the mid-70s this time of year. We're calling for highs in the valley in the upper 60s. 40s, though, in Flagstaff and at the Grand Canyon, too, and 57 in Kingman. Across the East Valley tonight, those lows will dip generally in the upper 30s as you head toward areas like the Santan Valley, Queen Creek, 38 and 39, respectively. Highs tomorrow bouncing back into the mid and upper 60s, mm -hmm. still below the seasonal average high of 75. In the West Valley, lows this evening staying in the upper 30s and low to mid 40s too. From Wickenburg, one of the cooler spots at 39 this evening, 42 in Buckeye, 43 in Luke Air Force Base, and 44 in Surprise with highs on Tuesday. Flirting with 70 degrees, we should remain though in the mid and upper 60s. Here's your 70 forecast. We go from 68 on Tuesday to 72 on Wednesday, but we do introduce that chance of rain again on Thursday with breezy conditions. High still at 70 that day, and we drop into the upper 60s by Friday. But look at that weekend forecast. Mostly sunny on Saturday with highs in the mid-70s, and then we're back in the 80s by Sunday, and even warmer a week from today. Calling for a high of 84 with lows bouncing back too in the low to mid-50s. Okay, thanks for watching.